hey y'all welcome back to my channel if you guys are new to my channel my name is baby scorpio or you guys can call me leah and in today's pick a card reading this is going to be what are my exes realizing okay so when i say my exes i'm talking about your ex-friends ex-lovers this could be ex-co-workers bosses those type of exes okay so it doesn't have to be like an ex-lover but I'm just saying X's in general, okay? So I have three piles for you guys. The first pile is going to be Labradorite and it looks like this. The second pile is going to be Citrine and it looks like this. And the last pile is going to be Amethyst and it looks like this. So I will have the timestamps down below in the comment section so you guys can check them out from there. Or you guys can choose your pile slash piles in the next clip. So let's get it. Let's go, y'all. So again, pile number one is going to be Labradorite. Pile number two is going to be Citrine. And pile number three is going to be Amethyst. I'm going to give you guys time to meditate. And we're going to get into pile number one. Hey pile number one, welcome to your reading. So before I get into your cards or anything, I'm going to tell you why you chose this Labradorite crystal. So with this crystal, I'm getting that you guys could see your ex-lovers, ex-friends, or even ex-co-workers in your dreams, okay? Like you can see this person in your dreams. I'm getting that this person heavily wants to communicate to you or this person has already communicated with you and they want some sort of like information from you, okay? It's something that you're very skilled in or that they've seen you level up in and they're like, okay, I need this information from this person because I've seen them go from like being a person that doesn't really talk as much to being somebody who is very outgoing, okay? So this person could have met you like in your shy stages or could have met you when you guys were like very insecure about yourself and now they're realizing that you guys are not so insecure. You guys are very confident within yourselves. You guys are very stable within yourselves as well. You guys are very grounded as well well that's what I'm getting so these people are realizing that you guys are building new foundations for yourself and they want a piece of the pie that's what I'm getting okay so you guys are like very successful and that's what they're realizing they they're realizing that you guys are the type of people of where they can't hide who they really are from you okay you guys see everything you guys could be psychic okay you guys could be a tarot reader or you guys could like practice in a cult or you guys just heavily follow your intuition okay they're realizing that the lies that they told you are really backfiring on them because now you guys have set up these boundaries that even if they wanted to go deep into a conversation with you, they know that they couldn't, okay? So they're realizing that you guys have boundaries, that you guys have upgraded your game, okay? You guys have upgraded this energy of yourself. You guys are high value. That's what I'm hearing, okay? So they're realizing your worth, okay? So let's get into your cards. So with your overall energy, I use the Moonlight Oracle deck and it says waxing gibbous and it says motivation. They're realizing that again, you guys are very successful. You guys have this energy to you of where you're not going to stop until you get exactly what you want. So you're very uh, motivational to be around. Like you guys have this very powerful leadership energy. Okay. They're realizing that you guys were the leader that they were looking for in other people. And now they want to be around you. Now they want to be around you because of how successful you guys are. You guys are overcoming these emotional blockages, these mental um, patterns that you guys have maybe went through in the past. Like maybe your mental health wasn't as good in the past, but now you guys have overcame that and now you guys are speaking out about it, okay? So they're realizing that you guys are getting your mental health in check. They're realizing how mentally strong and how strong-willed you guys are and they're like, oh my God, like, how can I be this person, okay? Because I'm getting like these people really want to be you. They really want to like follow you now. And I'm getting that 
if this could be an ex best friend or this could be an ex lover as well or a friend that was in this group with you okay like a friend that like followed somebody else when you guys left this group okay because i'm getting like you guys maybe left a group and this person or these people were like okay like now that this person has left like i'm gonna follow this person because i'm getting like these people are, they don't really have a mind of their own like they're really into following anybody and everybody to make them seem successful or make them like successful okay um they're not in their authentic energy they're more so like energy vampires that's what i'm getting these people are realizing that you guys are the leader that can actually lead them to the success that they want in life but I'm getting like, again, you guys have healthy boundaries to the point of where these people don't even feel comfortable asking you for certain information anymore. Like they don't even feel comfortable like coming back into your life anymore. So I'm getting like, you guys could have blocked these people. You guys could have like really put yourself in a position of where like you guys never want to see these people again. Like that's what I'm getting. Or after you guys have left you guys haven't seen these people again like that's what i'm getting so with your tarot cards i have the king of presents so these people are realizing that you guys were very giving you guys were very loving and you guys were the type of people of where you would do anything and everything for your loved ones or for the people that you truly loved and they're realizing that they can't control you anymore they can't put you in a negative mind space anymore they can't like try to tell other people about you in a negative way anymore because people are going to figure out that that they are the ones that are the negative people okay so you guys have like a really good reputation and that's what these people are realizing they're realizing that the reputation that they try to like form for you is not who you guys truly are okay so I'm getting like these people try to like put some sort of information out about you and it backfired on them so they're realizing that you guys are actually a good person and that people are going to stick up for you people are going to like love you no matter what you guys do because you guys are genuine people okay i'm getting that even if you guys blow up on somebody i feel like it's more so like this person deserved it so i'm getting like you guys really know how to manage your emotions and that's what these people are realizing with the seven of needles they're realizing that you guys's life is very private okay like you guys are very private people and you guys do things in an unconventional way okay you guys are not the type of people to tell your business to everybody you guys are very low-key you guys could have like a smaller circle of friends because of these people now and they're realizing that they don't have any access to you they don't have this energy of like who you guys truly are like they don't know who you guys truly are okay but they're realizing that you guys are very private like you guys keep your life low-key you guys are not the type of people to tell anybody and everybody what you guys are doing like you guys Guys may post your life but at the same time you guys don't tell everybody everything about yourself so there are parts of you that these people are realizing that you won't share with them okay and I feel like it really bothers them like you really want to know these parts that you're not sharing about yourself because it would help their ego okay it would help them feel better about themselves in a way of where it's like oh I know something about pile number one that you don't so it's like you guys are not the type of people to brag about who you guys are or uh, what you guys can do for others you guys are very grounded in that area like you guys are the type of people where you may give to others but not expect anybody to give to you back okay like you guys are very selfless okay and i feel like these people are the opposite and with the high priestess card i'm getting that you guys are very intelligent like 
you guys don't need anybody to tell you what's going on you guys intuitively know and i feel like that scares these people of how intelligent and how intuitive you guys are i feel like you guys see things for what they truly are instead of what other people are painting the picture to be and that's why these exes are like oh my god like i'm realizing that this person knew what i was doing from the start that's what i'm getting okay so it's like you guys may have known what these people were doing and that's why you have cut them off or you guys cut them off abruptly and these people are like oh my god what did i do like was it this was it that like they're trying to figure out what type of information you guys knew so that they can come back and apologize for that but you guys knew the whole story from the beginning okay i'm getting like you guys were getting signs from the universe that this person wasn't the best for your highest good and you were like okay i'm done with like trying to let this person in my life i'm done with like trying to control the situation i'm done so i'm getting like you guys may have told this person that you guys no longer wanted to see them or you guys no longer wanted them around you because of the negativity that they were like bringing into your life because i'm getting like these people love this energy of chaos or they're always around chaos and i'm getting like you guys are a very peaceful person like you guys don't like drama you guys are the type of people of where you guys don't need drama in your life i'm getting like these people are realizing that you guys solved a lot of these issues in their life and maybe that's why you guys are no longer around them because i'm getting like for somebody spirit actually removed these people out of your life because of the chaos and the drama that they were bringing into your life okay and with the full card you guys could be a sagittarius or this person could have been a sagittarius but i'm getting that you guys are very adventurous you guys are the type of people where you guys bring life into the situation like you guys can create from nothing and i'm getting like these people are realizing that you guys have many great ideas you guys are very curious about life you guys bring life into the situation you guys could have had like a child with this person and they're realizing that you guys are a great parent i'm also getting that these people are realizing how nurturing you guys are how you guys see things in an optimistic way and with the eight of candles they're seeing how excited you guys are about life and how when you guys were in their life a lot of good things were happening a lot of like celebration was happening i'm getting that these people are realizing how successful you guys are in your career or how successful you guys are with your personal growth like you guys stick to a goal until you guys accomplish it to the max okay so i'm getting like these people are realizing that you guys have people around you that actually care okay actually care about how you guys are doing what you guys are doing in your life i'm getting like these people are realizing the people that you guys have around in your life are genuine people okay people that match your energy in a healing way okay they're realizing how healing you guys were as well so with the ten of candles these people are realizing how dedicated you guys are how hard working you guys are how you guys will not quit until you get every single thing that you guys want okay how you guys are really good at manifestation um you guys may be secretive about your plans and these people are like well i knew them in the past why won't they tell me anything now so i'm getting like these people may feel a certain type of way because you guys don't tell them what you guys are doing now even if it's like friends that you guys have lost touch with and i'm getting like you guys may have like lost touch because of how they were treating you behind closed doors like spirit was like okay this person is on bullshit like we're done we're done with them we're done with hearing how number one's name in their mouth in a negative way we're done with that so i'm getting like these people may have like talked about you behind your back and they're realizing that you guys were always going to be successful no matter what they said about you because of the work that you guys put in and they're realizing that 
nobody really needed to help you on your path okay they're realizing that they needed you more than you needed them and now they're realizing that now that they're out of the way you're becoming more successful with them out of your life than when they were in your life okay so i'm getting like they're realizing that they were the success blockage in your life okay they were blocking you from the success that you guys truly wanted in your life and they're realizing that they were the problem the whole time okay so with your moonology cards i'm getting that this person could have been a taurus with the card your dreams need a practical plan and it says full moon in taurus or you guys could be a taurus or have taurus in your chart um or vice versa you know but i'm getting that you guys had a plan the whole time okay you guys had a plan when it came to these people like you were like okay if these people treat me in a certain way that doesn't make me feel good i'm gonna leave and you guys stood on business and you guys left and these people were like oh my god like this person was gonna leave the whole time this person had a plan to leave the whole time or i'm getting that you guys may have had a business plan and you guys decided to act upon this business plan after you guys left this best friend this ex-boyfriend girlfriend partner or i'm getting that before you guys put in your two weeks for a job you guys already had a business plan in mind or another job and that you guys didn't tell them that okay and now they're realizing that they're realizing that you guys already had a plan to leave and you guys didn't tell them that you guys were going to leave you guys didn't tell them that you guys were feeling a type of way they really wanted you to tell them like how you guys felt especially if it came down to like a job like they really wanted to know what was going on so that they could have offered you something else to make you stay okay and this person could have been an Aquarius with the card show the world the real you so they're realizing that you're becoming this more authentic version of yourself and they're realizing that they never got to meet the full version of you okay i'm getting that they never allowed you to be the full version of yourself like you always hid this version of yourself around them and i'm getting like maybe the relationship with this person or with this job or with this co-worker was very toxic so you guys hid parts of yourself around them because you guys didn't feel comfortable with this person or like in the environment that you guys were in like you guys didn't feel comfortable expressing yourselves and now they're realizing that you can fully express yourself without judgment like you guys have more confidence within yourself now that they're out of your life and they're realizing that they should have never treated you the way that they treated you in the past okay and with the card it's time to take action it says new moon in aries this person could be in aries or have aries in their chart but i'm getting that their actions haunt them to this day and they're realizing that again they never should have treated you the way that they did in the past and they're also realizing how courageous you guys are for taking the action that you guys are taking now okay they're realizing that you guys are going to do anything that you guys need to do for yourself and they're realizing that you guys are going to put yourself first now so it's like your value has gone up because of the self-respect that you guys have and because you guys are in your right mind i'm getting like this person or these people or this environment that you guys were in was like really a toxic environment that was keeping you down to the point of where you guys didn't really know who you guys were okay it was like you guys were losing yourself in this relationship or in this environment and so when you guys left this person or this environment or these people like you guys really connected to yourself by 
taking care of yourself again by nurturing yourself again by getting the help that you guys actually needed in order to move past this person or the situation that you guys were in okay and with the priestess of light oracle cards i have the card go with the flow it says letting go cleansing and receiving so i'm getting that now this person is realizing that you guys are more powerful by going with the flow okay um you guys are more powerful because you guys have cleansed this person out of your life because you guys are no longer allowing these people in your life or you guys have healthy boundaries with these people if you guys have to speak with this person okay because i'm getting like it could be the um parent of your child okay so i'm getting like maybe you guys have to have some sort of communication with this person but i'm getting that this person is realizing how calm you guys are how you guys are not dealing with their bullshit anymore and how you guys are standing on business okay and with the card earth magic it says fearlessness and removing obstacles these people are realizing that you guys have overcame any obstacle that they tried to put in your way okay any blockages that they tried to put on you or anything that they try to say to make you stay in the same place you guys have overcame those blockages and really move forward in a productive way okay i'm getting that you guys don't even talk shit about this person and this person is like after everything that i've done to this person this person still doesn't treat me in a way that is disrespectful so i'm getting like they see that you guys are a very good person on the inside and out and that you guys don't pretend to be somebody that you're not and with the card sacred purpose it says eternal flame and ancestor a legacy they see that you guys are making a legacy with what you guys are doing in your present moment the action that you guys are taking um what you guys are doing to heal yourself how you guys are treating yourself how you guys are treating children okay so um maybe if you guys don't have children you guys really respect kids or you guys may be a school teacher and you guys are healing your inner child by taking care of children in some sort of way or you guys are really healing yourself by taking this productive action in like a business and a career um and how you guys and how you guys talk to yourself and how you guys view yourself in your perspective okay so this person is realizing that you guys are more mentally strong um this person is realizing that you are mentally stronger than when they left you or when you left them okay and with the card wisdom it says learning joy art and music this person is realizing how multi-talented you guys are and they're realizing how wise you guys are how fast of a learner you guys are as well and how music or some sort of hobby is really healing you okay and with the card sacred breath and sound it says life force and communication these people feel so empty without you okay and they're realizing that you guys were the connection that they needed to move forward okay like i said before these people could have been heavily like draining your energy okay I'm getting like energy vampires like every time you came around them there was always some sort of drama always some sort of issue and now it's like you guys seem very peaceful very at peace with your life and you guys don't have to control the situation anymore like you guys don't feel the need to control the situation anymore and they realized that again they were the blockage that was keeping you from your peace okay and with your last cards they're actually from the power of love deck and it says individuality so these people are realizing that you guys are so unique that they will never forget you okay i'm getting that you guys could have changed these people's lives and now they're a better person because of you i'm getting that they're realizing that they will never find anybody like you ever okay ever in this lifetime that's what i'm getting and with the card transformation i'm getting that 
they are realizing that you guys have changed for the better they are realizing that you guys now see your worth that now you guys are more aware of who you guys are what you guys are capable of uh, your talents your hobbies um, they're realizing that you guys are more excited about life as well and with the card loyalty they are realizing how loyal you guys were in the relationship even if it was like a platonic relationship i'm getting like the people that they have in their life it's like they always have to kneel down to them and then with you it was more so like you guys were doing that for them so now it's like they're getting the karma and how they treated you in the past okay so it's like the roles are reversed okay like that's what i'm getting the roles are reversed in their life and they're realizing how sentimental you guys were and how consistent you guys were with the love that you guys gave them and how you guys were so devoted to them or so devoted to um the relationship like that's what i'm getting and how they played you over and over and over again okay and with the card respect i'm getting that you guys are heavily respected now and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that they should have respected you in the past because now they feel like they could have had like a better relationship with you but now it's like you guys have either cut them off you guys don't talk to them you guys don't care to talk to them and i'm not getting more so like that you guys don't forgive these people but i'm more so getting that they're realizing that they don't have access to you anymore so it's it's like they can't uh, know what you guys are up to they can't know the things that they would have known about you so it's like you guys have changed into a better person you're very loyal you're still very loyal that's what i'm getting uh you guys respect yourself now and that's what they're realizing and i'm getting like if this person has texted you and you guys haven't texted them back i'm getting that this person is realizing that you guys are leveling up in your self-respect okay so that was you guys this reading if this reading resonated with you guys make sure that you comment down below also make sure that you guys like share and subscribe to my channel see you guys next time and bye Hey pile number two, welcome to your reading. So before I get into your cards or anything, I'm gonna tell you why you chose this citrine crystal. So with this crystal, I'm getting that these people are realizing that you guys are not as fragile as they thought you guys were and you guys are very confident within yourselves you guys seize the day you guys are the type of people aware you're not going to stop until you get exactly what you guys truly feel you guys deserve and you guys create opportunities for yourself so i'm getting that these people may have had it all in the past or i'm getting that these people may have been a little bit more wealthier than you and now that you guys may be at the same level as them or you guys may have you know leveled up in your finances these people are realizing that it's not just your finances that they were jealous over it was more so you guys were in the inside okay they're realizing that the opportunities that you guys are creating are coming from your mental space it's coming from your ideas it's coming from who you guys truly are i'm getting like this could have been like an ex-roommate uh, i'm also getting it could have been like a best friend somebody that is in a fraternity or sorority or it could have been like somebody in your uh, religious practice that you guys may have like hung out with a lot okay you guys could have been to each other's homes and these people are realizing that they were jealous of you like the whole time but more so because of who you guys truly were it's like even if you guys were not trying you guys got every single thing that you guys wanted it was like every time that you guys put yourself out there you guys didn't really have to try and these people have to try over and over and over again okay i'm getting like these people are very jealous of uh the opportunities that you guys have in your present moment and i'm also getting that it's like these people are realizing how successful you guys are how the things that they've said about you don't really matter anymore to
to you okay so it's like they could have like tried to ruin your reputation or try to talk shit about you to other people that may have like wanted to like help you or like that could have helped you okay and they could have like try to ruin opportunities for you in that way but it never worked okay so they're realizing how powerful you guys are and i'm seeing the number 111 so you guys are walking into a new beginning they're realizing how emotionally intelligent you guys are as well and they're realizing that no matter how hard they tried or no matter how hard they continue to try for certain people none of the negativity that they're putting out there for others to see you in a different light is changing how other people feel about you okay or changing how you feel about yourself you're very confident within yourself you guys know what you guys want you guys could be leaders you guys could also just look at yourself in a higher light these people are realizing that you guys are not going to change who you guys are for them okay you guys are not going to change into a mean person for them ever ever in your life okay so with your overall energy i use the moonlight oracle deck and it says pyrite it says confidence luck and prosperity so i'm getting that they're realizing that you guys are moving up the ladder when it comes to like your finances and how lucky you guys are when it comes to like opportunities in your career or i'm hearing like in social media so maybe you guys have like a social media page and they're realizing that you guys are very lucky but i'm getting that you guys have like a strategic plan so i'm getting that these people are realizing how strategic you guys are and i'm getting that you guys may be like perfectionist okay or they may see like this perfectionist energy in you and i'm getting that these people are realizing that you guys are never going to quit on yourself even when they try to make you feel insecure about yourself try to point out things in front of other people try to um, make you feel bad about yourself in front of important people or people that you guys felt were important at the time like they're realizing that you're never going to make yourself feel bad about yourself ever again okay like you guys are working on your self-confidence you guys are working on how you guys feel about yourself you guys are working on how to communicate to yourself you guys are working on the throat chakra blockages that you guys may be coming up upon okay um they're realizing that you guys voice is very powerful what you guys say is very powerful they're also realizing that if you guys have like told them that certain things were going to happen they happened okay so they see you as somebody that is very psychic okay or somebody that has a deep or inner knowing about certain things and that's why they may have like been jealous about you in the past because it's like they may have like tried to gaslight you about um you knowing certain things and now they're realizing that you guys were right the whole time they're realizing that you guys have like seen beyond reality for a very long time and now they're realizing that you guys may be getting success out of just being your authentic self and i'm getting that that's why they wanted to make you feel insecure about yourself they wanted to make you feel like you guys weren't the person that you guys were truly um and like try to like make you feel down about certain parts of yourself that actually are helping you level up in your present moment okay and with your tarot cards i have the cards the nine of potions so with the nine of potions these people are realizing that you guys are a wish fulfillment that you guys have everything that you guys could ever imagine or you guys are manifesting everything that you guys could ever imagine and the only thing that is going to stop you is you okay so they're realizing that there's not much they can do or say about you or do to you because you guys are going to continue to get up and move forward in your life like it doesn't matter like what these people did to you said to you in the past you're not gonna let that affect your present moment or your future okay and you guys are not going to dwell over the past and 
that's what they're realizing okay with the five of presents in reverse i'm getting that these people are realizing that your luck is finally turning around okay you guys could have been through really hard times financially you guys could have been in certain situations that were not for your highest good especially like financially or like mentally and now that you guys are no longer in those situations and that you guys have like really cleanse yourself from that information um, really cleanse yourself from those situations or um, gain more knowledge to help upgrade you financially or mentally emotionally okay now your luck is turning around and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys are walking into a new beginning with your head held high and that you guys do not care about what these people think you guys do not care about how uh they really feel about you truly you guys are just on this reading for fun like that's what i'm getting um but i'm getting that they're realizing that they cannot stop you from the success that they wanted to stop you from in the past, okay? They're realizing that there's nothing that they could do to keep you from being your authentic self, okay? There's nothing that they can say to make you become the person that you guys were in the past, like to hold you guys back. There's nothing that they can do okay and with the hierophant card i'm getting that there was something that you guys knew and that you guys warned these people about and they're now realizing that you guys were right okay it's like you guys have like an inner knowing about something or you guys could have like told them that something was gonna happen if they continue to live their life a certain way and they did not listen and now they are living the karma for that okay they're living in the karma of like not changing their ways okay so they're realizing that you guys have changed your ways from who you guys were in the past they're also realizing that you guys have this connection with spirit that cannot be broken okay i'm getting that these people could be very jealous of your connection with spirit and how if you guys ask Spirit for something you guys immediately get it and that's how like they view it okay I'm also getting that they see that your hard work is always paying off they see that you guys are doing the shadow work that you guys need to do in order to move forward in your present moment and I feel like you guys are facing your fears and that's what they're realizing as well and with the sun card i'm getting that you guys are very optimistic about who you guys are and what you guys are capable of doing and they're realizing that you guys are not going to allow these people to change your perspective in your present moment and in your future okay i'm getting that these people may have like tried to make you feel bad about who you guys were and make you feel like you guys weren't doing enough and now that you guys finally like have gotten these people out of your life you're like okay i can really focus on what i want i can really figure out what is for my highest good and like explore new things experience new things without feeling so anxious okay so i'm getting like these people could have like made you feel very anxious or around these people you guys were very anxious and then after you guys weren't around these people you guys were very drained okay like these people were like stealing your energy like that's what i'm getting and now they're realizing that they can no longer steal your energy they can no longer put you in the situations that you guys were in the past okay and with the hang man in reverse i'm getting that you guys have overcame a lot of these mental blockages and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that the negativity that they try to feed you the negativity that they try to um tell to you say about you i'm getting like this could have been like a co-worker or again a roommate that may have like told you that certain people were talking about you and it's like in the past you guys felt really bad or in the past you guys may have been like people pleasers so you guys wanted to make everybody happy and now you guys are no longer trying to do that okay they're realizing that you guys have overcame this energy of people pleasing you guys have overcame this energy of trying to make everybody happy but yourself okay and now you guys are releasing this fear of not being liked by everybody and 
you're accepting that certain people will not like you okay even if you guys try your hardest you know there are certain people who just don't like you okay and you're accepting that and now they're realizing that okay they're realizing that no matter what these people say no matter what these people have done to you in the past you're still going to be this loving caring hopeful this prosperous person okay and with the empress card they're realizing that you guys don't have to chase what you guys want you guys attract it okay i'm getting that you guys are very attractive you guys have a, a very unique style and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys set the trends okay they're realizing that you guys were always the leader you guys were always the first pick the first option okay they're realizing that no matter what other people say about you you guys are always going to look within yourself and seek your own validation first okay and with the moonology cards i have the card expect powerful change so i'm getting that these people have seen you transform into a better version of yourself and they're realizing that they can no longer be in your life okay or they're realizing that you guys have changed okay they're realizing that you're not the same person that you guys were in the past you guys don't do the same things that you guys did in the past okay it's like you guys now have a connection with spirit okay like that's what i'm getting and these people don't know who you guys are like these people don't know what you guys like to do like these people don't know who you guys are besides what you guys post it's like they don't have that connection with you anymore they don't have that access to you anymore and it's all because you guys have changed and that's what they're realizing okay and with the card your commitment is being tested i'm getting that these people are realizing no matter what obstacles you guys come upon you guys are still going to be loyal to yourself your partner the people that you guys love i'm also getting that you guys are not going to leave people out that's what i'm getting okay so it's like these people may have like try to leave you guys out or try to like make you feel bad about yourself or try to make you feel bad about what you guys believe in okay and they're realizing that no matter what they think about you you guys are still going to believe in yourself or believe in your beliefs or gain this information that you guys feel is valuable to you okay you guys do not care about their opinion and that is what they're realizing okay and with the card don't let your past hold you back these people are realizing that you guys are either never going to talk to these people ever again that's what i'm hearing or it's like if you guys do see these people you guys are not going to act out of character okay you guys are not going to bring yourself to be angry at these people or i'm getting that you guys are not angry towards these people it's just that you guys have moved on with your life okay i'm hearing somebody say i'm too grown to be acting like this or i'm too grown to even care about how these people feel about me okay like i need to feel good about myself first so they're realizing how mature you guys are now. The Priest of Light Oracle cards, I have the card Loss and Lack. It says Fear and Victimization. So they're realizing that you guys are no longer in this energy of fear, okay? You guys no longer fear what they're going to say about you. And they're realizing that you guys no longer see yourself as a victim. You guys have control over your life. You guys have control over your emotions. And you guys are not going to allow these people to make you feel bad about yourself or feel bad about your life or the life that you guys have created, okay? You guys take action when you guys need to take action. And you guys are not afraid to move forward okay and with the card build your own world it says creation expansion and networking like i said before you guys could be really big on social media okay and these people are realizing that these people are realizing that you guys are gaining the success and how well you guys are in networking okay it's like you guys have made these connections with people that they never thought you guys could make okay the numbers 31 and 33 could be very significant okay and with the card river of blessing it says releasing constraints so 
I'm getting that you guys have released these people and that's what they're realizing. They're realizing that you guys no longer want to be a part of their lives or you guys have like cut them out completely and they're realizing that you guys don't need them around to be successful, okay? So maybe these people had some sort of wealth and they thought that you guys were using them but in reality they were projecting that okay they were projecting how they were using you and it's like you guys are successful by yourselves you guys don't need these people to be successful you guys have made your own money you guys have like leveled up this could be an ex-husband or wife or like partner that's what i'm getting and they thought you guys were using them for their money and you guys have like popped out and now you're like uh i got my own money like what are you talking about like uh i did this by myself so I healed by myself like that's what I'm getting okay and with the card clairvoyance it says inspiration interpretation and trust so I'm getting that you guys were very trustworthy and that's what these people are realizing these people are also realizing how well you guys were at interpreting like certain business deals certain communication from other people um, certain messages that they would get okay um, maybe they got messages from spirit and you guys were really well at interpreting that and i'm also getting that um they're very inspired by you and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you inspire a lot of people and how inspired they are by you okay it's like they go back and forth from like being inspired by you and then being jealous of you and being inspired by you and being jealous of you like that's what i'm getting okay with the card hostilities it says conflict and unrest they are realizing that you guys are going to stand up for yourself no matter what no matter where you guys are they're realizing that you don't care to be problematic okay if you need to end a problem you're going to end the problem okay you're going to speak out on what's going on you're going to speak out on how you guys truly feel about the situation and you're not going to care you're not going to care about how these people feel about it in the moment like you're not going to care like you're gonna speak up for yourself and i'm getting like these people may have like tried to make you feel bad about yourself for speaking up for you and you're like i don't care about that i don't care about none of that like i i don't care like i'm gonna speak up for myself okay so they're realizing how you guys are really coming into your voice really speaking up on things that really matter to you okay that's what they're realizing and with the card action from the power of love deck i'm getting that you guys have the courage to move forward and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys are not going to quit until you get exactly what you deserve you're not going to stop yourself from being your authentic self you're not going to stop yourself from being the person that you guys are meant to be in this lifetime okay and with the card spontaneity i'm getting that they're realizing that you guys embrace new situations they're realizing that you guys will start new and fresh and that you guys do not care about how other people feel about it they're realizing that you guys don't care if you guys seem wishy-washy to this person you guys are going to do what your heart desires okay and with the card friendliness i'm getting that you guys make very good connections in your life and that's what these people are realizing they're realizing that even the friends that you guys may have had together these friends still like you even after they have like tried to ruin their perspective okay and i'm getting like it's because you guys are a genuine person like this person is realizing that it doesn't matter what they say to other people you guys are still going to move forward and form these connections that are healthier for you okay it doesn't matter what they tell other people about you you're still going to put yourself out there and um, be authentic they're realizing how friendly you guys are okay and with the card expression they're realizing that you guys are really expressive in your hobbies they're realizing how your expression is really bringing you balance okay they're realizing that you guys are going to speak up on what you guys like what you guys don't like what you guys feel is right what you guys feel is wrong you guys are going to speak out on things that you guys are passionate about so i'm seeing the numbers two to two so 
that could be very significant you guys could be seeing the numbers 222 a lot but i'm getting that you guys are coming into this balance and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that they may have like turned this relationship into something very toxic and now they cannot get it back okay so that was you guys this reading if this reading resonated with you guys make sure that you comment down below also make sure that you guys like share and subscribe to my channel see you guys next time and bye y'all Hey pile number three, welcome to your reading. So before I get into your cards or anything, I'm gonna tell you why you chose this amethyst crystal. So with this crystal, I'm getting that these people are realizing that you guys are stepping into your power. They're also realizing that you guys are becoming a very healing and very nurturing person even more, okay? So you guys are leveling up in how you guys take care of yourself and how you guys take care of other people. You guys are also leveling up in your protection, like your uh, physical protection and your spiritual protection as well i'm also getting that you guys are very intuitive so they're realizing that you guys are listening to your intuition more and that you guys are following your inner guidance a lot more and that you guys are really focused on a particular goal in mind okay like a particular goal that you guys are focused on and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys have like tunnel vision towards some sort of goal and that you guys are really focused on that they're realizing that they're no longer the focus and that you're taking your power back from these people okay so with your overall energy i use the moonlight oracle deck and it says gan ying it says goddess of compassion so they're realizing how compassionate you guys are how you guys are again nurturing yourself and nurturing other people how you guys are like nurturing your plans and really stepping into your power to like focus on a goal and reach the success that you guys want you guys could be a scorpio or have scorpio in your chart or this person could be a scorpio I'm also getting that this person could be an old roommate, um, somebody that you guys were very close to. So I'm getting like an ex, like mother-in-law, sister-in-law. I'm also getting like it could be an ex-lover or an ex like classmate, okay, or ex-classmates, okay. So they're realizing how compassionate you guys are, how you guys are really good at maintaining the projects that you guys have for yourself, okay. So you guys are not going to like start a project and then like leave that project you guys are really going to maintain that project until you get the results that you guys truly want in your present moment and with the eight of potions this person or these people have realized that you guys have changed your direction and changed your mindset on like a certain situation okay so i'm getting like um you guys may have had like a falling out with this person and you guys had to change your mindset in order to move forward in your life and so they're realizing that you guys have changed your mindset that you guys have like not looked back from being in a relationship with this person that you guys continue to move forward and that you guys are no longer like allowing them to control your emotions anymore so you guys are really like focus on yourself focus on your self-love focus on what you guys can do in your present moment to move forward in your life and with the judgment card i'm getting that you guys have carefully chosen a decision for yourself to move forward and they're realizing how carefully you guys choose to be around certain people okay they're realizing how you guys use your discernment in a lot of the situations that you're in and how you guys carefully plan out your goals or plan out like the things that you guys want for yourself okay i'm getting that you guys are visionaries and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys are efficient planners you guys are really great at like time management i'm also getting that they're realizing that you're really good at like budgeting or planning certain things out okay and with the three of potions they're also realizing that you guys are a really good person to have around when they need help okay so i'm getting that you guys really help this person through a lot of difficult situations in their lives and now that you guys are no longer in their life it's like they don't really know what to do so you guys had a lot of good advice when they needed you guys the most and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that 
you guys are team players and that you guys are not as selfish as they thought you guys were in the past okay and with the night of candles i'm getting that you guys have many great ideas you guys may be like physically strong but like that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys um have upgraded like your physical appearance they're also realizing that your ideas have brought you out of like a negative mind space and that you guys are really following your intuition really following what is for your highest good instead of following what they may have like tried to make you do in the past or um try to like get you into in the past like you're really following your own intuition and following what is for your highest good instead of like trying to do everything for these people okay i'm getting like you guys may have been people pleasers in the past and they're realizing that you guys are no longer uh people pleasing in your present moment okay and with the ace of candles this person believes that you guys have so many amazing ideas that you guys are bound to bring a lot of opportunities into your life like you guys are creating opportunities for yourself and they see that you guys are like carefully planning out these ideas so that they can come into your reality i'm getting that this person didn't expect you guys to level up as much as you guys have especially when you guys have left this person's life but now you guys are like really stepping into your power really seeing what you guys can do for yourself really like believing in yourself and believing that you guys are worthy of uh, your manifestations worthy of moving forward in your present moment and um, that you're not afraid to ask other people for help okay you're not afraid to like learn something new like um you're not afraid to be the student anymore okay like that's what i'm getting like you're not afraid to like step out of your comfort zone and ask people for help ask for what you guys need okay so with the five of potions i'm getting that you guys may have like felt bad about what happened in the past or they're realizing that uh the things that you guys may have felt bad about in the past you guys are now moving towards new opportunities in your present moment so it's like the negative things that happened to you in the past did not stop you from becoming this person that you guys are in your present moment so you guys are breaking free of this negativity and you're really uh getting the help that you guys need you guys are asking more questions you guys are working through your shadow work and really stepping into your power that way and showing yourself the compassion that you guys need in order to move forward in your present moment so with the moonology cards i have the card a fiery climax approaches it says full moon in aries you guys could be in aries or have aries in your chart or they could be in aries or have aries in their chart but i'm getting that you guys move with passion and that's what this person is realizing this person is realizing that you guys have found this inspiration or this passion within you and now you guys are teaching others to be in that same energy or you guys are teaching them to be in that same energy as well so i'm getting that you guys are very headstrong as well and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that there's nothing that they could really do to stop you from becoming this person okay becoming this new version of yourself i'm getting like they're realizing that they're not going to meet another person like you okay like you guys are one of a kind and with the card surrender to the divine i'm getting that you guys have surrendered all this negativity all this control that you guys have over this situation and you guys really like are overcoming it okay and that's what this person is realizing this person is realizing that you guys are like really stepping into your power by accepting the situation for what it truly was and you guys are taking back your power by taking the action that you guys need to take in your present moment or creating new projects or healing yourself through these new projects or these new ideas that you guys are getting i'm also getting journaling so you guys could be journaling a lot or you guys could be just working through a lot of like shadow work you guys could be going to like therapy or uh you guys could be leveling up in your career and these people are realizing that you guys are really healing yourself from the negative situations that happened to you in the past okay the negative situations that um happened while you guys were in a relationship okay and 
with the card conclusions are reached within it says full moon eclipse i'm getting that you guys are changing and that's what this person is realizing this person is realizing that the old you is no longer coming back you're realizing that you guys are no longer going to be the same person that you guys were in the past because you guys are learning from your mistakes you guys are learning your self-worth like you guys are leveling up in what you guys thought you guys were capable of in the past okay so you guys are changing your perspective and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys are upgrading your mindset you guys are upgrading how you guys perceive yourself how you guys perceive the world um the information that you guys are getting like you guys are learning from life okay and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys are upgrading your appearance as well and how you guys are working on yourself like working on your self-love you guys are uh, working on your self-concept they're also realizing that you guys are protecting your peace of mind okay and how or what you guys say to other people okay so they're realizing that you guys are showing a lot of people more compassion by what you guys say or um, you guys are correcting how you guys say certain things okay uh, so you guys don't hurt other people's feelings that's what I'm hearing okay and you guys are really stepping into your power by being authentic but also like cleansing this energy of like anger out okay they're realizing that you guys are becoming less angry with yourself and with them okay and with the priestess of light oracle cards i have the card power over difficulty it says reclaiming your power like i said before you guys are reclaiming your power and really stepping into this energy of being like okay this is what i can do for myself and this is how i can move forward for myself and i'm not going to really focus on what this person is doing how this person feels about me i'm really focused on how i can protect my energy and like do what's for me i feel like you guys are really focused on what you guys can create in this lifetime like i feel like you guys have like really seen what you guys can do or this person has realized that you guys are more powerful than what they thought because you guys have completed something okay i'm getting that this person has realize that you guys are more intelligent than what you guys come off to be or uh what they thought you guys were in the past okay and you guys are really reclaiming your power in the wisdom that you guys have okay and how you guys are learning and what you guys do learn okay i feel like you guys are reclaiming your power in that and that's what they're realizing and with the card twin flames it says soul partner and eternal connection so they're realizing that this connection was real okay and they may have like ruined it or they may have like turned it into something that was very toxic okay and now you guys are reclaiming your power and moving forward from this person like they're realizing that you guys don't need them around to like feel good about yourself or feel validated okay i'm getting that you guys validate your own self so you guys don't need them to validate you in any type of way and that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys are very courageous and that you guys are always going to step out of your comfort zone no matter how scary it might be you guys are always going to face your fear of like stepping out of your comfort zone and with the card setting boundaries it says threshold protection and honor so with this card i'm getting that you guys are honoring yourself by setting up boundaries and i'm getting that these people are realizing that you guys are no longer allowing these people either in your life or you're no longer allowing these people to do you the same way that other people have done you in the past or they have done you in the past like they're realizing that you guys are reclaiming your power by setting up boundaries and by uh telling people no telling people what you guys want what you guys don't want uh what you guys will tolerate what you guys will not tolerate and then standing on that okay so with the card courage it says strength fearlessness and family so i'm getting that you're realizing that you guys are very close with your family or that you guys have very loving connections in your uh with your family or with your family members i'm also getting that they see you guys as somebody very fearless and they're realizing how courageous you guys are like i said before and how you guys have like this inner strength to move forward and it's really helped with like your mental health or how you guys perceive yourself how you guys perceive the world um how you guys have moved forward with your projects okay i'm getting that you guys may have like started a project that this person is like really interested in and they realize that 
you guys have to have like a lot of courage to move forward in that project so that's what they're realizing they're realizing that you guys have a lot of courage because you guys partake in like a certain hobby or a certain project that you guys are doing right now or you guys have completed that project and they realize how courageous you guys are because of the completion of that project okay and with the card friendship I'm getting that this could have been like an ex-friend or somebody that you guys were around a lot. I'm getting that you guys were very supportive to this person and that's what they're realizing. They're realizing how um, you guys uplifted this person's mood a lot. Like you guys were always the person to like uh, make them feel really good about themselves. Like give them compliments and you guys were really like that solid person in their life. Like somebody who was like very committed to them. Somebody who was um, not afraid to be around them. Like even uh, through the, uh, even through like their tough times. Like that's what I'm getting. And they're realizing that you guys were not afraid to have fun, okay? You guys were not afraid to be your authentic self and have fun and, um, like, work hard but play harder. Like, that's what I'm getting. Like, they're, they're realizing that you guys are able to have, like, this balance in your life when it comes to, like, your rewards, okay? And with your last cards, they're from the Power of Love deck, and it says Virtue. So I'm getting that. This person is realizing how much you guys have helped this person grow um, just by you being your authentic self, you guys showing them compassion, you guys like really encouraging them to be their authentic self as well. Like they're realizing how loving and caring you guys were to even help them grow as a person. Like that's what I'm getting. And with the card creativity, they're realizing how creative you guys are in your ideas, in your career, and your mindset and like uh, the perception that you guys have on the world that's what I'm getting uh, they're realizing how you guys use your creation to release like this sorrow okay and they feel like that's very creative and with the card freedom I'm getting that they're realizing how open you guys are now how you guys have released yourself from these limited beliefs this mindset that you guys may have had in the past they're realizing that you guys are really coming into your confidence and you're really stepping into your power reclaiming who you guys truly are and accepting who you guys truly are in order to move forward in your present moment they're realizing that you guys are not somebody to play with okay like that's what i'm getting and that you guys are not going to put restrictions on what you guys can do you guys are always going to believe in yourself okay and with the last card it says tolerance so they're realizing that you guys put up with a lot of things that you guys didn't have to put up with okay they're realizing that you guys have like really stepped into this energy of like setting healthy boundaries because of that i'm getting that they see that you guys see other people's points of views but you guys are still going to like share what you guys know okay so it's like you guys are not afraid to share what you guys know and like communicate like have a deeper conversation with people and see like where their head is at and see uh their perspective in life okay like you guys don't shut people down just because you guys don't believe in the same thing okay and that's what they're realizing so that was you guys this reading if this reading resonated with you guys make sure that you comment down below also make sure that you guys like share and subscribe to my channel see you guys next time and bye y'all